Today I'm going to review Tai Lopez's 67 step program. This will be a completely honest review. I bought the program with my own hard earned money and I will be reviewing it with brutal honesty, the pros and the cons. So if you're interested, keep watching. Hi, this is Sonia and welcome to another session at Live to the Fullest. Today I'm going to review Tai Lopez's 67 step program. Now if you don't know who Tai Lopez is, he is this multi-millionaire who lives in Beverly Hills, California and has I think numerous businesses and has aggressive marketing for his 67 step programs and you'll see his ads on YouTube and of course his famous Lamborghini and garage video that most of us know about or have seen it at some point or the other. Let's talk about the cons first. If you see my screencast here, this is the payment page from which uh, I made the payment and I bought the program. The one thing that I didn't like was that in the, in the beginning steps, nowhere was it mentioned explicitly that you're also signing up for a recurring payment, that you're signing up for this recurring coaching slash live sessions with Dai Lopez on a monthly basis. When you actually get into the purchase mode you think that you're going to buy the 67 step program only the program and it's not very explicit about it until you come to the payment page and the payment page then uh, you know has this sneaky little fine print that your next payment is due or you're going to be billed on uh, July 2nd like in my case that is annoying why do you have to sneak it in I actually like Ty Lopez a lot I've seen a lot of his YouTube book reviews and I think they're very valuable. I think he is a great teacher. You obviously cannot fake it. If you haven't read the book, you can't talk very confidently about it and his reviews are long. His videos are normally very long. So I like him and I think a lot of people who explore his program will have some level of affinity towards him or liking towards him. So for him to sneak this in for some reason, I didn't find it very appealing i would rather the person say that yes i'm also selling you the subscription and it's totally fine i'm not against that i'm here to purchase but don't sneak it in like don't just kind of quietly put this in uh didn't really appreciate that so be careful if you are planning to purchase the program this is one thing you will have to keep in mind that it will automatically sign you up for this recurring charge and it may not be very explicit about it in the beginning now it could be that uh, you go through a different link the link that i went through this is what i saw on the screen of course you can also cancel it right away the moment you sign up it gives you all these options of how you can cancel the program how you can refund get a refund for your money if you're not happy with the program it gives you all the steps it gives you the number the email I am showing you how to cancel the recurring membership that comes with it and the very so you have to go to the help section right here and uh, you go to please click here don't cancel while you still have knowledge to gain and you know it'll So then he goes through this video, of course, I don't want to show the content here. And then he talks about these member benefits. And if you feel that you need these resources, then absolutely keep your membership. Absolutely no doubt about that. Then I'll say continue canceling. And finally, you get to this page, uh, which says you successfully canceled your VIP membership. Um, and this was my 14 day trial, so it shows me the state. So I have opted out of the VIB membership. When I went to the program, the titles were so enticing and the, and the thumbnails are misleading too. You feel that, wow, there's just some great BBC documentary kind of professional footage coming your way. But it's just him talking. So this, as you can see, is what his website is. Uh, these are the different lessons and uh, you just scroll and every single day one video opens up and uh, one new video gets unlocked and you also get notified by email. Um, 
So as you can see, some of these titles are really catchy, very magnetic. My Poor Friends and Cameron Diaz's Parrot. So who wouldn't want to click on that? Very enticing. And the value you get from these lessons is, uh, is amazing. It is immense. However, I feel the thumbnails are a little bit misleading. Uh, you, you'll think probably, right, that uh, there are some clippings and slides in there or uh, the very first one also shows this, uh, this really fantastic image. However, it's only Thai really talking. So it's a bit misleading, but the content is very good. It is a podcast and I uh, wanted to just show you these titles that they are so attractive. Billionaire's Brain and Jennifer Lopez's Voice. So, of course, I don't want to show the inside of the lessons because that might be a violation of copyright and I don't want to do that. But I did want to show you an inside peek of what the program looks like. Another con that I felt about the whole program is that it is not a structured program. I mean, I am a structured learner. I, If I'm paying for a program, I want it to be structured. The videos are not well connected they're not connected at all they're just individual 67 videos uh now that can be there can be good things about that and not so good things about that the good thing is that they're very independent videos you don't have to see it in a serial format you don't have to see the previous one to understand the next one and that's a that's a huge advantage the disadvantage is that when you're paying money you you want something more structured uh, it feels no different than watching his independent separate YouTube videos. He sometimes also tends to ramble, which if you've seen in videos, I mean all of us ramble at some point or the other, I'm probably doing it right now. But uh, he tends to ramble and that was a bit disappointing to me in the videos as well. The videos are just purely him talking, which is very similar to what you will see in his YouTube videos like I mentioned before. and. At some point it becomes rambling because like I said, it's not structured. You're not getting tuck, 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 you know, points A, B, and C. Another con that I hated was, this was my pet peeve, you could say. I am not a pure audio learner. Now, over the years, I have trained myself to listening to positive motivational audio information podcasts and cds and audio books but that's a trained skill i've i've been into self-help for almost nine years now a little bit almost a decade now his videos are not true videos i mean there are no slides there is no visual clippings no professional input really so to say it's just ty lopez talking on the video and really it's a podcast you don't even have to watch him. You can just plug it in and just hear it. Again, there is benefits to that. You don't have to actually sit down and take the course. You don't have to actually sit down and see the video to understand the content. You can just plug it in and keep working, keep driving or cooking or you know doing your chores and actually listening to it. The only thing I wish was that they would have mentioned that. So I would have come with that expectation that these are not 67 videos, they are actually a podcast program. And that's totally fine, there's nothing wrong with that. But just, I think the expectations were not set. So I was hoping to see some videos and some, some more professionally put content in there. Because I honestly didn't find any difference on the way he does his book reviews on his free YouTube videos versus this paid program. Uh, so I wish that there was a little bit more of a professional touch and more for visual learners than just audio learners. So keep that in mind. If you're a visual learner, you have to be prepared that this is just a podcast. So I got introduced to his existence through his ads and I started seeing his YouTube videos on his book reviews and I enjoyed them to some extent. I didn't like all his videos. He has these for some reason really muscular men and women in skimpy dresses while he talks about some personal development or some business uh, guidelines which I think is a is a weird mix of two niches but hey the bottom line is if I you don't want perfection in someone bottom line is that 
when he talks he does make sense the overall feel that i get from him is that he does know his stuff he is worth the salt he knows what he's talking so when he talks you can make out that the person has read a lot of books that's what he's famous for reading a lot of books he has read over 5,000 books which is what really attracted me because that is a feat that is amazing probably more he's probably read more and when he talks you can you can make out that he has read the book and he knows what he's talking about the the program definitely adds value no questions about that whatever he's talking makes sense is motivational is empowering uh, it will help you you will pick up something that will help you absolutely no doubt about it like the law of 33 percent i really liked it i had never heard of it that you should spend one third of your waking hours with people below you one third with the people at your level and then one third with people above you and why you should do that and how you can sustain it or uh, picasso's rule about how geniuses steal as far as value is concerned it delivers now i actually have also enrolled in other self-help programs for over a decade now and compared to the prices that i pay there this is very cheap i mean 67 dollars is one dollar per video that is actually relatively very inexpensive the other program that i've been part of of course that is a little bit more targeted information but uh, I have four CDs a month and one book a month so it's kind of like a subscription program and all of this I pay with my own hard-earned money so it's about $50 a month and I get four CDs and a book so that's about six to seven dollars per CD and that is also an audio CD it's self-help it's motivational and I've been part of it for years so compared to that this is one dollar per per video slash podcast which is very inexpensive so if you are a newcomer then i would recommend that this is a good start absolutely no doubt about it it's a good way of getting into a habit of listening to positive information one of the reasons why he calls this as 67 steps is that according to research it shows 66 to 67 days for the mind to actually build a new habit so that's why he has these 67 steps which is basically to get into the habit of listening to positive motivational information and and i agree with that this this it is a habit that one has to cultivate for years i'm still more of a visual and a kinesthetic learner i learn by experiences i learn by visuals by videos by slides uh, my least preferred method is audio but i knew that if i really wanted to grow myself internally i had to train myself uh, for audio learning and i did that but it took me some time so if you want to get into the habit of audio learning then this is a great option very inexpensive great option ultimately the biggest pro is that Tai Lopez is a great effective communicator i absolutely love that part about him i mean some people can be very jazzy and snazzy and they really are not delivering value but in his case if you actually see his videos or book reviews he is able to deliver value you will get value he is and he is very knowledgeable his famous knowledge style and he is very knowledgeable he knows what he's talking about he's read a lot of books you can make it out and he has a tech talk on it as well after weighing the pros and cons if you still decide to go for the program i do have an affiliate link and yes i will get paid if you use that affiliate link so haters if you're listening i've made this very clear in summary i feel that if you are a beginner and you have not been part of self help programs ever this is a great start it's inexpensive uh, you just have to be prepared that it's a podcast it's not a structured program on the other hand if you are an intermediate or an advanced learner who's who has already been in self help industry for a while i would say that this will be a little bit disappointing but again the price point is really low so if you don't think that $67 is a big deal then just go ahead and invest it but I think for advanced folks this will probably not cut it with that I'm done and don't forget to subscribe see you next time